this my journey has nothing to do with 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 the book uh, a life of Messiah. This is a separate uh, uh, journey last night. Uh, strange God who will never will come to know by his creation. They are a, a mysterious or such a mysterious journey <coughs> when I come back from this Eternities and my spirit come in my body, I feel uh, my body, I feel like I'm uh, even my spirit that I'm freezing. Though I'm, I have been called by God, His heart, um, but the journey which I would like to share here, uh, as a human, uh, make me pieces. Uh, every time I. I feel like I never came to know God, uh, even zero point. The God I have spoken, the God I have, who has given promises, but how far these promises goes, and where I end up in this human creation. Oh. Even right now I'm thinking about God. My mind blew up. So my spirit bring me so far in crossing many other eternities. And when I'm coming back, I don't feel this capacity in my body, in my mind in my awareness, the state of conscience, even my emotion that I can handle where my spirit have taken me. But what shall I do? I am a If God wanted, I carry this burden. His sorrow, his strange nature, which make me extreme fears. Meeting God in my life, I have uh, my 
every instrument is crying out. My body, my mind, universal consciousness, conscience, my heart, emotion. You have not a capacity. Ever will come to know this strange God again. Before I begin my journey, I'd like to share there was a one point when I was uh, begging God and pleasing God since you have created this human creation you don't want to show yourself if you are on the universal light or universal consciousness who you are actually. And I ask God, uh, like uh, on this human creation, uh, our loved one keeps their photos, their picture. So if you let have one, one of your, allow me your this picture, God said to me, I have no picture. So I start sharing here and I say to God, um, in my own life, people ask me, you made this card, how this card looks, how expresses. And I always became speechless. So human nature, human creation, when their loved one is not with them, they keep their pictures. When they look at this picture, their emotion, their feeling, their memories, all come back. And they remember very intensive, very deeply their loved one. They miss them. I know you are a God. You have no picture, but when you was cooling down your light, you show me yourself, actually. So, if you show me in this form, because of human nature, as my nature, I want to see you, some kind of form. So you cool down your life and you Make your form, you make your, this form, and I know when you don't cool down your light, then there is no picture, there is no form, then all creation is 
object of your light and you are a subject. Beyond and beyond and beyond. We will never come to know who you are actually. It's up to you if you don't want to meet this human creation or very seldom or you all those countless creation how you see how you feel but if you allow me to have to make your picture then at least human being have a reason in hope to live. That one day they will meet you, they will see you and in this human creation there was so many great human being which offer everything, they lost everything to see you a few few blink, few blink and then you never meet them again. So when then I start crying and I say when you along with this you picture we have a reason to live. At least some hope is there that our, you are our beloved one. One day you will not forget us. There are countless human beings who were the great Messiah and prophet and saint. who came in this human creation, but they had one wish in their heart and mind to meet you. This was a so few moment and with this moment they have lived their whole rest of their life. But they could not share those moments with this, their beloved one, about you. Because they got a loss, their every instrument got a loss and they could not handle this. this loneliness which they experienced with you, they became so empty. If I say this is not a mental state, but this is a sick mental state was. I don't say this is a bad way, but they went so far that they lost their own human identity, human nature. So allow me, you have called me your heart again. So allow me at least to have your picture. So the future children, when they will be small children and grow, at least when they will see your picture, they will say, yes, this is our father, this is our beloved, this is our God. And with these dreams, to 
could live the rest of life will be more easy for mankind. I was then I was sharing many tears and and I saw God was feeling compassion for me by kindness was feeling very sorry for me. And I was sobbing and I was sharing tears and I say, I do not know since in which time this human creation began. And then I was so much sobbing and shedding tears. I said, God, why you call me your heart? But I cannot have this one gift from you. This day God felt very sorry and said, I have never allowed someone to make my picture because I make this picture because of you, so you don't get. Fear or you don't get my overwhelming light and dominate all these creations. So. So I come up, cool down my light and I, I came to you with this. So if I look at my mission all my life, at least I can give one gift, God picture. So, not for all mankind or not all creation, but in human creation, whoever have given his all what he has and even God created him with life, gave him life. He gave back life with his love. And such a human being was there. Amazing grace of you, amazing grace of God. And I'm very deep touch of my Sufism ancestors that they, after meeting you, they became forever silence in internal life. Whenever I meet them in internal life, they express their sadness with tears. There's no word they have, they became speechless. And you were saying that I am their fruit, I am their wish. So God allow me to make this uh, picture, but I was waiting uh, uh, long enough before my one 
member camps. Atal, who was a painter too, first of all was not possible. But I have praised so many times from God making prophet. Meet, let him meet you so he can. I become his eyes and he become my head. So after a long time pass, this wish was heard and I he was living in South Africa. And this picture I was made with I was challenging how God looks. Even he made God many times and he even if he sees some, some person, he can make a pictures. But even in memory, he can make. But here, every time he met, he could not catch gut picture. So, God was saying to me, you are the only human being that my picture will remain in your eyes and in your heart. So I have explained all the time every feature, how God looks, his eyes, his face, his old form making. For me, this gift which I have offered to human beings for me is a more than I have given them kingdom of God. I have given them something more than love. I have brought the picture of this creator who is the subject of love, who gave birth to love. My heart cry out that all mankind come to know what God is opening his heart to one human being like me, but all my life went through. Very less people join my movement. End of the life now, all over the world. God bless this technology positive way that people have opportunity to come to know how God looks, come to know what God is speaking to his researcher. So every time There are so many journey, but every journey make me uh, only one feeling which I share sometimes, cry whole night. I cannot. I'm so sleepless. Sometimes I'm so tired actually.
I feel bottom of my heart and this spark which you call soul, which I call soul. Observing all this thing and across the journey of many universes and many eternities, I feel I lost this feeling to be home actually. Even in general life I never feel home any place. But only short moment. I don't know how to open my heart that they will be always your loved one. You Every new creation, new dimension, they will be your loved one, your family. But after a while, you have to say goodbye, and the next dimension will be again a new family, new loved one. It's a very strange feeling. So, at the heart of God, I have many vertical journey in the in the path of God. It makes me that whole eternal eternity I have no home actually. I cannot express this uh, situation, this feeling. It makes me crazy many times. I ask myself who I belong to, where I belong to. I cross many eternity. I even met God. But after all these things, I got again lost myself, like a zero point. Such a journey made me speechless. Sometimes I feel I should become silence forever. But not to share all those things. This will be not a good justice. For humanity and for God, for this eternal life. And when I think what God say, I will never find another like you. It makes me more desperate feeling, I, if it is sorrow or there is a panic, there is a fear. I, I don't know what is this inside of me that If I don't share these things, the researchers which are coming in the future, if they are not today, they are coming near future. This the researcher of God. I should share, I must share. And this foundation, which is beyond this love, 
it possible they become far greater people than I. So at least I will not feel home, homeless in eternal life. I will not feel lonely. I have a hope. Of course they are a vertical heaven. Where this light, time and space is in present. My eyes have seen those eternity and heaven of special beings and sons and daughters. But who will allow humanity to go so far? My eyes see mostly humanity in, end up in the dark dimension, in hell, middle dimension, good middle dimension, neutral dimension, paradise. There are so many countless creation, but once while one spirit make in centuries. And the bitter truth is, which I should share with human creation, Even paradise, there are so many creations when I end up or land their creations. They don't welcome me. That's a bitter truth. If they would be dependent on their power, they would kick me out until I land in to this earth. But I don't know if there's a compassion, there's a kindness, there's a pity or God feels sorry for me. Or in German we say mit like mit Or what he found in me And one day when I was, one moment when I got the opportunity to meet God, I was so much in tears and was saying to God, your creation blocked me. They don't even allow me to go further. You spiritual beings, they are so powerful and those creations. Angel is the one of creation, but there are so many. And this worries that what I came to know in those dimensions, they meet you in a few moments and they never meet you ever again. They are thirsty and they are hunger in sadness. And I myself, never know that when there will be opportunity to make me, meet you again. I'm very much aware that knowing your value is, can be million, billion years the next opportunity can rise.
However, in my however in my case, you felt so much nearness that I could meet you. Many occasion. So at that point, God felt so sorry and compassion for me and with feeling. He said to me, from now on, nobody will. No creations will stop you. If there is a horizontal creation, there is a vertical creation, no one will stop you. At this point, this beloved God was was shaking himself, and so many big, like a like arrow, but there was so fat these arrows. There came many thousand from God, countless, and was going different direction, and God said, "Go." Go and they should become part of you. I show my limitation and I say, God, how is it possible that I can even go one direction, but they are all over direction, uh, flying more than lightning speed. Even one direction I cannot catch. He said, just go one direction. So, with my limitation, I fly one direction and then God says, every way, north, east, west, north, south, down, up, everything, God says, come back and become part of Zai. So they all came, those arrows, light arrows, and went inside of my my spirit and God blessed me and then God gave me one thought and he says when any creation any heaven will my eternities not internal life my over eternity block you just rise in your hand this thought and they will make a way free for you. And many countless give it it. Please gonna come out. They will hear my voice. And nobody can stop you away. So I got this opportunity and now this last night there was a one of night the reason I want to share if science said there was a big bang we call almost 14 Arab. I don't know if it's a billion years ago, but I have to be correct this. This big bang happened and this uh, life was expanding then in this creation. But last night I was crossing many big bands beyond the eternities. Cross many eternities. And what I became so pieces in fear and pounding. And uh, 
overwhelming. I thought I would become a mental sick actually. How I gonna express uh, this humanity? There was a not if one big bang will like begin. Beyond this, there was a, so many big bang. But what strange? I f I cannot express express actually that this creator, this God is so strange, who will never will come to know by his own countless creation. So I was crossing many big banks and what I saw not playing one role here. In this mysterious journey what I saw, every big bands, universal life began and then Many creation exists. But how should I put my word that afterward word if God get tired of all these creations or whatever motivation is, but he wiped out life. And then, beyond the times, some place, time don't play any role, new big thing. So he made, he destroyed, he made, he destroyed, he made the life and in the end. He packed this life so when I was traveling those eternity I cry out I say God why you create me so to see all those things with my eyes to experience all those things. How I will explain about you that you are so strange, God. That you create one universal Big Bang and life and then time come as a you destroy this life. Feel comfort with you. Who gonna call that one day I will be home? Who gonna bring this creation back to home and all this creation who has their loved one and beloved one? Who going to bring them again one opportunity in this internal life? If I share this thing, God, there are going to be right so many questions mixed with out of fear after loneliness and sadness. What kind of God is this God who create life and Then billion or trillion years, he wiped out this life and created something new. Even 
my spirit was flying, I was shaking in this. Before the bleak, I could cross the eternities, but how I will tell? I'm not even able to tell this human creation. This human creation who don't want anything to do with you anyway. For them it's most important their own wishes or at least their loved ones and children, but they are not interested in you. And even they want to finish your need and then come times. You create life and you finish them it. And then they are hanging like a balloon in many eternity when you gonna <coughs> make possible that they could find their home, find their love, find their destination. In those crossing many eternity in this space, one place I start shaking. How I will tell about you? How I, which word shall I bring God? They will say, what kind of heart is this? Even he by himself don't know. his own destination. He even by himself don't know where went all those lives. Many times Big Bang happened. Then came time when life was was packed and there was nothing. And then no one know time is no value in the eyes of God. And how many times Big Bang, how many times life. So in this space of eternity I was so much sad. I was I don't know where to go. In this moment I saw one front of my reaction. Such a bliss happened like here. All eternity are shining. And then I saw that this universal light this being came out who we call God who we call Ishwar who we call Heavenly Father who we call the most beautiful According to our relationship we have, the seeker of God has called, have given different name according to their love, according to their spiritual growth. Then I thought the whole universal eternity was again in darkness and because God 
came out and all this universal light it was sh giving light to all the eternities went inside of him and he walked to me I said to God, where shall I go? Who shall I speak? Who shall I share? You have called me your heart. You have said I'm the founder of your love. God, I beg to you. I cannot fulfill this value, Abel, what you have called me. I myself have lost. I don't have any answer for, for those creation. You allow me with your light, light, light. Many creation longing for you so they can find their loved one and beloved one. And yet you never came back. And now when I go back, I never tell. This was not a first Big Bang. Beyond was life, then destroy, then life, then destroy. God, how I going to tell them this? What kind of God you are? In this moment, God hold my hand and say, my beloved one, stand up. You don't have to tell them, eh? no creation, because you have no authority to tell them when I will be there. But then again I saw when God was holding my hand, like a Bliss came light from God and all eternities beyond this big banks, all those eternities are shining. But you can tell wherever you go now or to human creation. I have not forgotten anyone. I have not forgotten any individual. I have not forgotten my any of creation. They are all before my eyes. Tell them. Even you feel yourself as my heart. I can see your heart beyond this many curtain. You feeling again like a zero. You don't know where to go. You don't know where to feel home. And you will never ever come to know 
where I come, where I go. I have given you so many opportunity with my creations are waiting that I should visit them. It is not enough for you that I have given you my heart, my light, my power. That you're going to bring all those creation which disappeared in past or present or in future one day in one meeting point. And you will be called my heart that you are this my heart who went beyond this many big bang to see the life and when life was over with your own eyes and you have experiences all this pain and sadness this is my pain and my sadness Zaye this is my broken heart this is my emptiness This is my loneliness, what you're feeling inside of you. So just say today, God take everything away you cannot handle. Now I give back to your identity. And live someplace for in one dimension, in eternity or heaven. Or carry continue because I have found you. I have told you so many times, I will. I'm creating again and again big banks. And then life goes beyond this. And I told you I will never find one like you. You can say today, Oh my beloved creator, you cannot handle this. Then I go continue as a, all by myself. But I don't know if I will ever, I will create many times, many creations, but I don't know if I will find one more like you. So make a decision today. You want to carry on all what I'm going through? Or we can say goodbye. to each other forever. But I will never forget in you. You will create more pain, more emptiness, more broken heart in me. And I will carry this plus more sadness about you that there was a someone who I thought I found my home and now he can go on it. If you cannot carry the burden of this 
love. If you cannot carry all my pain and my attendant, my emptiness, what I went through, and my heart, I will never put all my burden on your shoulder. I just have given you this case. What I go, what I'm going through. Then I take away this moment away from you, so you can have a breath to live. So make a decision. You want to leave me alone? I will never bother you again. But I will never forget you. I will search continue somewhere. One more like you. Now you got it when Popeye many times big banks I let you experience and then this life I wiped out and became part of past. But they are existing someplace in other eternity. I was so speechless. I bowed down his feet. I said, God, please forgive me. God, you are a God, I'm a human. I'm a one small part of your, one of your creation. Allow me to carry this burden. I want to go on actually. Otherwise, who gonna bring me home? Who I gonna give information what I know to this human creation and other creation? At least in this way I can be hope for all this creation. When God heard this thing, He embraced me very tightly. And says, I hold on. Carry on. You have a long way to go. Internal life is a beyond one eternity. You have very far to go to tell about me. There was a man who came to know, but they would not share who I am. And look at your human, your human creation. are so much hungry and thirsty. There are many special children were born. They were born in past, born in now, and future. Where they will find my address through you. They will love you like me. They will remember you you have not left them behind them. So you hold on and whatever you're going through, you must share. 
Otherwise, who going to be founder of Maida Bakery? Who going to be bring home all these creations? With my light, my light, all this eternity is shining, you see. There was a countless Big Bang, but I am not forgetting any creation, creations. But through your love, I will meet all this creation. They will become one meeting point. I was so broken heart, I don't want to ask God, when will be this? Because I know this answer. Even Creator don't know when will be this all. Countless creation will be meet one meeting. Then God said, let me go, let me, let me go, and then suddenly he disappeared in space, and I as an old man, young spirit, but old man, like a I can't tell my age. If I'm oldest being in this, all this creation, or who I am, my spirit came back in my body, and I saw that my body was crying so so much that this pity was wet. I say to my body, don't, don't cry, you will not die. There will be always new form for you to live at this search again through all your eternal life to meet your beloved God. Afterward, I, I felt so tired, but my tear was not stopping. Morning rise, but I don't know where to go. Where to find this God children and where to find other creation. So I have shared here in hope if in my lifetime those beloved ones special, son and daughter cannot appear and my spirit will research them in the future. And I'm recording this all in hope that they will be beyond so great that they have the answer for all things. Maybe they are the one who will be light of God and represent God's heart.
Who will be my children, my hope, my joy, my strength? Who will be my children, my hope, my shoulder to bring God to in this point that one one day when no one he settled down and the strange nature of God. I don't know if we ever will come to know him, but maybe we can bound him with some promises that not to go such a way that never look back. Maybe we can bound him with some promises of love. Where hope will be continued, even many big, big pain will happen, many kind of life, many kind of destroy, many time eternity will be cross and one other eternity, cross and another eternity. How far we have to go? Maybe there will become someone who will be far beyond far beyond greater. I had a very desperate wish in my will of God all my life to find them. However, unfortunately, I could not make it. Maybe there will be someone who will make it. That's so why feeling now light in my heart, I feel more while recording this thing, I'm feeling somewhere, sometime in the near future. Someone will come to know more value of God more than I. So I will find one day these people will be home for me. So I can, I will continue my journey in spiritual life. Thank you.